Betway sponsors Frotch vs Groves 2 on Sky Sports. Coogan Cassius, IFL TV, in association with Betway. With me, I've got Jamie Moore here at Broadmarsh Shopping Centre. <laughs> I called this Broadmoor earlier. Yeah. Broadmarsh, isn't it? <laughs> you might not be far. far right, easy, there, careful. You haven't left I'm Nottingham yet. Playing, I'm careful. Um, Frotch v Groves, the, the fight week starts really today with yeah. uh, the, sort of the activities leading into the into the fight on Saturday. Uh, ask your opinion. Do you watch uh, the gloves are off on Saturday I night? Watched it last night. Right, and, and what, uh, is, what was your take? Fresh on it? in my mind. I just think the, the, the shock factor has gone now. You know, Carl Frotch is dealing with the uh, the mind games a little bit more. Uh, Groves looked a little bit like he was getting to the end of where he thought he'd, he'd have an edge over Carl, and it wasn't coming, and he was sort of lost for words. So uh, I think I think that was that was a little mind game one, but I don't think. All these mind games are going to, you know, play a factor in the end of it. I think Carl's he's been seeing a sports psychologist. That's going to uh, put him in good stead, better, better stead than he did last time. I think he let himself get wound up. He's not, that's not happening this time, and the shock's not going to be there. So we've had fighters in the past say before people like Chris Eubank that you know if there was a one percent chance that they thought what they were saying to a fighter pre-fight was going to get into the head they'd do it you yeah. know so yeah. do you really blame someone like George or Carl for, for Listen, getting he, involved in he, this he, he's doing what he feels best or the best way he can get a victory over Carl Frotch Carl's gone away looked at the mistakes he made from the first fight and fixed them and came back mentally in, in a better place so uh, but you know uh, uh, the long and short of it is it's going to be a great fight without a doubt they're going to go in there I think I think personally I think Groves is going to box a little more but I think that'll give Carl the opportunity to put, put more pressure on him and when you're be, when, when you being made to work rather than uh, setting the pace yourself it's, it's much tougher so so I think Groves will eventually hold his feet and have it have it with Carl So you're going with Groves? I'm not I'm going with Frotch Are you going with Frotch? I think, I think um, I think Groves is right in what he's saying. He's got quicker hands, better feet, maybe punches a little bit harder than Carl. But I think at the end of it all, it'll come down to the tougher, tougher man, and I think that's Carl Frotch. All right, sorry, I couldn't hear you with all the crowd. I thought he was uh, swaying towards Groves. You're going with Frotch. All right, well, listen, Jamie, thanks for talking to us, and uh, we'll look forward to seeing what happens this week. Like I said, Frotch is about to do his uh, public workout in front of a packed shopping centre here. Yeah. Can't People used to turn out for you, this All sort of crowd used to turn out for yeah, you. At least, to... at least 15, 20. Yeah? yeah? Yeah. In my own living room, that was it. You're gutted that we never used to film this. I would have got you. Yeah. I would have made you a lot more famous I, than what I, you already I are. I know for a fact, if you was about, never mind Eddie Earn, if you was about when I was boxing, I'd have been, I'd have been selling the MEN Arena. Absolutely. Definitely. Cheers, <laughs> <laughs> Jamie. Cheers, mate. Betway sponsors Frotch vs Groves 2 on Sky Sports.